Okay, there is a whopping 21 audio diaries in Pauper's Drop. There is a few of them in this general central area. One you don't get until the very last one. Which made sense in my head. You don't get it until the very last, uh... It's the last one we'll get in this level. Let's go with that. So you do that. Um, it's not very hard to navigate. Of course, as always, I get these in the order you will get them. As much of a pain in the ass that is. I actually have to go back and get them all. I do it for the professionalism of this video and for the sake of you guys. And by the way, this is for nextgenwalkthroughs.com. This is Mr. Frags from ArvagainGaming.com. So, the next level, Siren Alley, has even more audio diaries. So, the video is probably going to be a little bit longer. I don't know how, but I managed to cut this one down uh, lower than the last one. Whatever I did there. The thing about this one, though, there may be one or two of them out of order due to the fact that there's no definite order you can tackle these, and it depends if you actually beat the level first or um, go after them while you're doing it. Keep in mind that you cannot come back to levels like you couldn't Bioshock 1, so if you missed it and you left the level, you're shit out of luck. So make sure you get them all before you leave. There's a list of them if you press back or select or whatever. Tells you which ones you've gotten. So this one's a little tricky to get to. You can't really go through the front door. You gotta go through that little hole in the wall. As you can see, some of them are around the same area. I just tackle them in a different order than maybe you might. It's all based on preference and how you're noticing stuff. Because, of course, I gotta find them. I don't have a guide to use to find all of these. So, I gotta actually look around and find them. So if one of them's out of order, give me a break. Because even after I find them all, I gotta go back in the editing process, the post production, and put them in order. And you'll see towards the end of the video, I actually picked one up, but I very cleverly described how to get it. Not really cleverly, it's just kind of a little annotation. This is where they might get out of order. I grabbed this one on the top floor, and then I had to jump down to the other floors and grab the rest of them. Because I actually missed them. This is room 106. This is on the first floor. Uh, you gotta actually go into the bathroom to get it. And then this is a little bit before where I got the one on that balcony you just gotta run up here on those broken floors and grab it that one's a little tricky to find and this is really an apartment complex and most of the walls are broken down um... i'm gonna warn you now the last one you get see there there's a little diary it's right where that little uh... where it said it was the video don't lie the last one you get by killing a brute splicer. So if you freeze them, you notice I have freeze on my drill right now. And uh, I actually killed a brute splicer before him. I think you fight three in this level. The second one, I froze him and broke him. So don't freeze him because if you break him, you cannot loot him. See this guy right here. So just kill this guy with a gun or something. Then loot him up and you'll have all the diaries in this level. 